Boyd. We're looking to jump in here. First bounce. Get this game underway. Flinders University Stadium, Sturt and South, both looking for their first win of the season. Doyle got it up quickly. Battersby, a little kick forward. Matthews couldn't pick it up, but Snelling can. Good kick, moving forward. Home, well done. Two attempts at it. Tried to keep his feet, just lost it in the end. Pressure on. Loose. Picked up, good handball face. Barks to home, open and goal. The double blues. Again, switching back in play. Good tackle. That's a great tackle in the end. I think I knew that was coming. And that's a terrific tackle and a reward for effort from Bradley. Opportunity for Shoe back to go forward oh, with their hands on the back there. No, the up I said that's all good. So we have great Southern Footy League with great nicknames of their clubs. Quick kick, re-entry. That's another attempt. Not not paid. Fit was it? Maybe it was touched. And in the end, up I said I'll have that one. Perez just laying the tackle, but fair. I reckon he's got a fair argument that that was a mark. He's done well, Max Clifton, over the last few minutes. We saw Hone get that first goal, but uh, just in game number two, Max has been very good, as has Shubak, who delivers the ball out to Arundel, and we've seen a fair bit of him as well. He goes centre-half forward. Yeah, great kick, as you said. So here's Collins, inside 50. Pretty much man on man, and then coming up defensively to try and cover that stoppage off, doing a great job. Matt is Peter. With a clearance, Faye Sparks, he held on to that nicely. And Faye Sparks goes at around about half a goal a game on average across his 74 games. And that is a really, really good kick. So the Blues have got two. Back and forth till they can finally find an avenue inside 50, but Summit and the skipper, good hands. The centre was Will Snelling, Guy Page. They combine up really well. Running himself in a bit of trouble there was Perez, but this is the turnover now. Bedford, can he hit a target inside 50? Good poise. Yeah, nicely delivered to Howes. So Anderson will get a 25. Look to hit a target and on the lead and lead up. That was really nicely done. From Shoeback and coming through with a handball heads towards Carey. Good support from Matthews going back towards the line and the bounce. Oh, I think he's all right. I think Jimmy Matthews has snuck it through. <laughs> he has. What's the inside 50s now, uh, Biggles? So 23 11 in favour of the double blues. Ooh, it felt like there was a gap. Mm. Well, here's a chance now. And they go in kick. and it's a great kick to free tag. Really nice vision there. I think it was Davis. He'll take off down the middle of the ground. Courageous kicks, Matthews nearly took it, but this is going to be a turnover. It might be Collins bringing it back in underneath it. Terrific Mark Wilkinson. Flick over the top comes to Matthews via Dakin. He gets onto his left into attack and good mark. Backed himself there with Schroeder. Read it well, left his man. Second Terrific. game player. This is outstanding, isn't it? The Megan's handball yes. intercepted. Hurry. Kick going forward. Free tags the target. Got two oh, hands to it. Wilkinson. Coming through Wilkinson. Let's see what he can he do. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, what a cracking goal. <laughs> well, we've got an early contender for the Channel 7 goal of the week. <laughs> Coming off hand, Wilkinson. That's just the crumbing work we're talking about. Truck assist replay. How does he get that ball to talk like that? That was amazing. Terry uh, Alderman couldn't swing it like But he did coach in the 70s. There was a lot of long hair in the 70s. Yeah, there was. But Marty Leslie and the crew were just let that flow, weren't they? They weren't holding up there with the rubber band like we're seeing nowadays. It's a good mark taken there. And Ollie Davis fires it off quickly. But the umpire is going to bring it back. And got one of the double blue boys, Ollie Davis. And he's going to... Have to shoot from outside 50 on a 45 degree angle. It's probably right on his measure. Kick. Oh, that's a good kick. That is a really good kick. Well, not as it just on his measure. He's blown that out of the park. And great start for South in the second half. About Douglas. And here's a chance for Duncan. Been really impressed by his form. 
today. As you said, he had a really good game against the Crows. He hit 26 touches. Works a handball back. Nice kick by Duncan. Howells again. Good hands. Strong mark by the young man. Kicked three last week. And so he's had three yeah. shots at it, which is, you know, what you'd want. Mm. Good hands, as you can see. Didn't deviate, but looking inside 50. Runs around. Now wants to put it to a dangerous spot. Who can meet it? Goes through a lot of legs. Matthews comes out of the pack, and he's going to kick it. What a magnificent goal. It's his fourth. Ingettable shots on goal. Burrows the target. Good hands. Just called Hillman in to get it in down, and then quickly... Oh, going to one-handed. Becker was good there. He comes home. Can he just draft him in a magic? Oh, wow. This is the pocket we saw Wilkinson. Breaking. Just lobs it in there. At the back. Good high leap, Burrows. It's McFadgen at ground level. Hooks around one. Can he get his second? That's a magnificent snap. What a goal, Connor McFadgen. Snelling gets... One, just missed the target, and I think that's Carey getting wrapped up by Wilkinson. South, deep in their 50, they'd like to get a score here. Here comes Fit again, bustling his way through. Rogers to back up, spat it out. That's a nice piece of work there, I reckon Jake Arnell might have. Arundel, he's finished it. South Adelaide this year, coming across from the Box Hill Hawks, gets his first goal in the Chemist Warehouse replay. It was a good snap, wasn't it? And certainly looking comfortable at Sanford level. Walter missed his target. He was looking for the skipper. Comes into Bradley. And able to give it off to Sampson. We know he's got some toe. Arundel. And good his kick. kick's a really good kick. Terrific vision by the former Fox Hill Hawk. Yes. And little kick is good. So Liam Fitz able to get it from Arundel. Fit from 55, top of the square, and Mark couldn't be taken. Coming down on it though was Wilkinson and snaps it through three seconds. Might have hurt himself, I reckon, Will Cumbless in that marking contest. Bit ginger. He's a brunette, isn't he? Oh. <laughs> I'm the Wilkinson, he's had a crack at goal here. I reckon it's gone all the way. He's got his third. What a sensational kick.